So your Samsung A14 is not turning on, it's not starting, you have the black screen. So my phone works, but if yours doesn't, we will first press and hold both power and volume down and we'll keep this held down for a good 20 to 30 seconds. So you won't see anything show up, just keep these buttons held down. And so the first reason why you have this issue is not because your phone is faulty, but because the software froze. And so by doing this key combination, we're gonna try and unfreeze the software. So if you see the Samsung logo release, until that point, just keep on holding those two buttons, give it a good while. Now, if that solution works, excellent, but if it doesn't, we need to look into it further. So if there was an issue where you just couldn't charge the phone, and that's why it died, or you just picked up the A14 after a while, it's not charging. What may have happened here is that there is gunk and dirt in the port which is causing the problem. So let's look into this. We need to get a flashlight so we can get another phone. I mean, if you just get a torch and we're just gonna shine it into the charging port. So my port is nice and clean. There'll be a secure connection with a charger. But if yours isn't, we may need to remove the dirt and gunk. So you can use a pin, um, you can use your SIM ejector tool, you can use a needle. I have these thin tweezers here, and you can also use a toothbrush too, but this isn't as effective. So what we do is we're just going to insert the tool in the bottom right of the port. So just insert it, and then push it across and pull up. Okay, do this a bunch of times, and you should see dirt and crap just coming out, and then repeat the same for the top right. There is a middle separator here, you can rub against it and not cause damage, but if you feel like too much resistance, just stop what you're doing. Make sure you aren't putting too much force on, okay? Now with the brush, just rub the brush inside that port, get the bristles in there, okay? And then give that a little while, and try and charge the phone, see if it turns on. If still not working, the display or battery cable may have unplugged from the phone. So what we can do, is try and plug it back in. So we're gonna start from the back of the phone, get two fingers and just push as hard as you can across the back of the screen. Okay, so push as hard as possible, all right, and repeat this motion for the entire back of the screen, all right? So just do the full back, do the same with the front. Then go on the back, make sure the phone's on the table, get one hand for support, and the other, we put two fingers and we just tap as hard as we can across the back of the screen. Okay, put maximum force into this one. Make sure you cover every single last corner. Then do the same for the front. You want to have a hand like supporting the phone so it doesn't like wobble. You can see it's wobbling there. So if my hand's supporting it, it won't do the full front as well. Then get two thumbs, just push them as hard as you can to the center of the screen, okay? Just push like this, all right, okay? Just like that, and then repeat the same with the back too. So the objective is you should hear like a click sound, and that just means the display cable, the battery cable is back in the phone. So either you can just long press the power button to turn on the phone, maybe charge the phone for a bit, or do that power and volume down combination. And so hopefully we're in business. Uh, if you're not, the phone must be booked for repair.